American Samoa is an island about halfway between Hawaii and New Zealand. There are about 56,000 people on five islands and two atolls, although most of the people are pretty crowded around the coastline on one island. The harbor there is called Pango Pango Harbor. It's one of the deepest harbors in the world, so large, large ships come in and out of there all the time. People from Samoa are nationals of the United States. That means that they have passports from the United States and can work in the United States and travel freely. In American Samoa, Rail Pacific is partnering with a research alliance for college career and life readiness. The research alliance is made up of educators and other stakeholders from the K-12 system, from American Samoa Community College, from the local government, and from the community. All of these people have come together to work on this problem of how can we support students in being more ready for college, career, life, the military, whatever they choose after they graduate. Many Samoan high school graduates are assigned to what's called remedial education when they enter the local college, which is called American Samoa Community College. Remedial education is for students the college deems not ready to enter into credit-bearing math and English classes. So they take math and English classes to quickly try to catch up and be ready for college. But during the time that they're in remedial education, they're not making progress towards graduation and they're paying for those classes. So a chief purpose of uh, the work that the Rail Pacific is supporting there through the Research Alliance is to decrease the number of students who are assigned to remedial education, which would mean that more of them are prepared to succeed in college and graduate from college and get uh, good jobs. They've worked on this problem in part by, ex by using data about students. And in American Samoa, they have a very comprehensive and modern data system, it's called SLDS, the Student Longitudinal Data System. What that means is you, the system tracks students from kindergarten through the time that they graduate 12th grade. Over the last year, Rail Pacific has worked with the Research Alliance to explore the Longitudinal Data System. The data system is relatively new. It's only come online in the last few years and people are still trying to understand what to do with it. What's the power of longitudinal data? the American Samoa Department of Education is implementing this year, during the 2014-15 school year, they're implementing a five-year comprehensive plan. It's the first comprehensive plan in the history of American Samoa, and it's designed to improve the outcomes of students through addressing the whole educational system from teacher quality to teacher qualifications to the involvement of the community to support for Samoan language and culture to new accountability structures, new accreditation structures. It is an ambitious project designed to get more students ready for college careers and life. That's the explicit goal of this plan. And Rail Pacific is working with stakeholders in Samoa to help them monitor, implement, and evaluate that plan as the plan unfolds so that they can make changes to make sure that they reach their goals, which is really to help students have choices in the 21st century when they graduate high school.